Who wants to see me eat a whole tub of ice cream? Nobody. Okay, so let's take a look at the new releases coming out this week. Hello, and welcome to Parents Got a Game. My name is Seth. I want to thank you all for the 100 subscribers. We're now about 105. It's been a little bit such I should have done the video earlier, but I didn't. Now let's take a look at the new releases coming out October 25th, 2022. The first game on our list is Bayonetta 3. This is coming on Nintendo Switch. The ring is mature. The content descriptions, blood and gore, intense violence, strong language, and partial nudity. This is an action game in which players assume the role of an ancient witch that battles against angels and demons in a fantasy world. Players use hand-to-hand -hand combat, pistols, giant cysts, axes, and magic to kill enemy creatures. Players can also perform various finishing moves which depict in exaggerated and intense acts of violence. Enemies throw into spinning and spiked wheels. Characters decapitated by a guillotine, a dragon ripping characters apart. Large blood blood effects and gore can be seen frequently. During the course of the game, some female characters perform suggestive taunts and poses, outfits that occasionally shed during the battle, with characters' breasts and buttocks partially exposed. Swear words appear in the dialogue. Next up is Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. This coming on PlayStation 5, Xbox Series X, and PC. The rating is mature. The content descriptions, blood and gore, intense violence, strong language, suggestive themes, and use of drugs. This is a first-person shooter in which players assume the role of special forces unit and members pursuing terrorist threats. Players engage in combat missions using machine guns, sniper rifles, knives, and grenades to kill enemies. Combat is frantic, highlighted by realistic gunfire, explosion, cries of pain, and blood spatter effects. One sequence depicts captured soldiers tied to chairs while being interrogated. Captors may aim and shoot a pistol directly at the camera and character's face. Finishing moves depict characters stabbed repeatedly and or shot in the head at close range. Blood and gore effects and often accompany these sequences. A red light district depicts neon signs with female figures advertising live sex theater. Other signs reference lingerie and fetish SNM costumes. During the multiplayer events, players can use badges and banners on their name cards, some of which depict cannabis leaves, joints, and or smoking figures. Swear words appear in the game. The next game on our list is Resident Evil Reverse. This is going to PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and PC. The rating is mature. The content descriptions, blood and gore, intense violence. This is a multiplayer third-person shooter based on the Resident Evil franchise, in which players complete in death matches against other online opponents. Players use pistols, machine guns, and rocket launchers to kill opponents in fast-paced and frantic combat. Combat is highlighted by realistic gunfire, large explosions, and frequent blood splatter effects. Some attacks result in characters exploding into pieces when killed. Players can also assume the roles of various monsters that perform finishing attacks, often resulting in large sprays of blood. Some environments depict several animal heads and entrails. And the last game on today's list with a full description is Resident Evil Village. This game on Nintendo Switch, the rating is mature, the contra descriptions, blood and gore, intense balance, and strong language. This is a survival horror action game in which players assume the role of a man searching for his missing daughter through a wintry village. From a first-person perspective, players explore environments and use pistols, shotguns, and machine guns to shoot and kill fantasy creatures found throughout the surrounding area. Some attacks result in decapitation and or dismemberment of enemies, often accompanied by large splatters of blood and some areas depict large bloodstains and entrails within the environment. Cutscenes can depict additional acts of intense violence and gore, a character's heart ripped out of their chest, a person chopped through the shoulder with a machete, a character impaled through the chest with a giant weapon, a person repeatedly shot, swear words are heard in the game. And the rest of the game on today's list are also coming out, but no information was available. Thank you to bensound.com for the music track. Please follow Parents Guide to Games on YouTube at Parents Guide to Games, on Facebook at Parents Guide to Games, on Twitter at ParentsG2G, and email any questions or concerns at ParentsG2G at gmail.com. And always, please subscribe and thanks for watching.